Nicotiana rustica, Wikipedia article audio. Nicotiana rustica, Aztec tobacco, or wild tobacco, called Uacuc in southern Mexico due to its Mayan roots, Mapaco in South America, and Thuaclao in Vietnam, is a rainforest plant in the Solanaceae family. It is a very potent variety of tobacco. The high concentration of nicotine in its leaves makes it useful for producing pesticides. Uses Thuacilao Mariotu Nicotiana rustica is often used for entheogenic purposes by South American shamans. It contains up to nine times more nicotine than common species of Nicotiana such as Nicotiana tubicum. Other reasons for its shamanic use are the comparatively high levels of beta-carbolines, including the harmala alkaloids Harman and Norarman. Most commonly, in South American ethnobotanical preparations, it is allowed to soak or be infused in water, and the water is then insufflated into the stomach in a preparation known as singadu or singa, it is also smoked in cigars, used as an enema, made into a lickable product known as amble, and made into a snuff with the bark of a species of theobroma, creating nu nu. In the southeast part of Turkey, people use this herb and ashes of some tree bodies to make a moist snuff called mariotu. They use this by putting the mixture under their lips like Swedish snus or Afghan naswar. It is also a common admixture of ayahuasca in some parts of the Amazon. N. rustica is no longer cultivated in its native North America, as N. tubicum has replaced it. In Russia, N. rustica is called makhorka. Historically, Makhorka was smoked mainly by the lower classes. N. rustica is a hardy plant and can be grown in most of Russia, it was more readily and cheaply available, and did not depend on transport in a country with an underdeveloped road network and climatic portage problems. This remained the case until ordinary tobacco became widely available in the 20th century. During Soviet times, Rustic tobacco was an important industrial crop of agriculture. In those times, dozens of varieties were bred, some of them considered equal in quality to N. virgin Iana. In modern times, Makhorka is still sometimes smoked by peasants and farmers due to its high availability and being almost for free for them. N. rustica leaves have a nicotine content as high as 9% whereas N. tubicum leaves contain about 1 to 3 percent. In Vietnam, it is most commonly smoked after a meal on a full stomach to aid in digestion, or along with green tea or local beer. A ha tea of Thua si Lao is followed by a flood of nicotine to the bloodstream inducing strong dizziness that lasts several seconds. It should be said, however, that even heavy cigarette smokers have had trouble with the intense volume of smoke and the high nicotine content, and that side effects include nausea and vomiting. The main difference between smoking thua si lao and the use of other tobaccos is in the method of consumption, in that thua si lao is consumed with a water pipe. The smoker is presented with either a bamboo pipe called AAIA degree UCAY or a ceramic hookah called AAIA degree UBAT. It may also occasionally be smoked in a more uncommon pipe known as AAIA degree UANG. The pipe is filled with an appropriate amount of water and a small amount of thua si lao is pressed into the bowl. One then ignites the tobacco and inhales to create a body of smoke inside the pipe, before exhaling the smoke, reversing the process of air in the pipe by blowing into it to pop out the tobacco. The smoker then sharply inhales, usually tilting the pipe upwards to an almost horizontal position. Thua si lao is usually smoked out of a bamboo pipe, the AIA degree UCAY 
which can cost from 10,000 AANG to upwards of 50,000 AANG for pipes with extravagant carvings and other designs. Mario Tuo is chewing variant of Nicogiana rustica. Commonly used by people who live in Marie. Mario Tuo is a mix of oak tree ash and Nicogiana rustica that resembles henna. It is recognized as a drug by anti-drug activists. It can contribute to mouth cancers.